loves welcome back to a new video so today i'm going to be showing you guys how to get a really beautiful florist base with some fenty products i got a bunch of stuff from them and honestly i'm in love with all of their products so i thought why not try a full face of their um makeup we're gonna also do a little chit chat because i know you guys love these types of videos and before i jump into the video i'm going to do my post notification shout out and today's one's going to go to sammy thank you so much for showing so much love girl i really appreciate it and if you guys want to get one next time all you have to do is subscribe press the bell button and then let me know in the comments below or you can just leave a nice comment now i'm also really excited because skillshare is sponsoring today's video well, skillshare offers thousands of classes for creative and curious people there are many topics on there such as photography design illustration creative writing and also things like leadership business analytics freelance and entrepreneurship there are honestly so many resources on there classes provided by actual creators and experts um, out there so that you can build your skills for the future now their classes consist of a combination of video lessons and class projects that you can easily fit into your schedule because they're only an hour long or so i do really resonate with this platform because i do feel like it's never too late to learn something new or build on the skills that you already have now a lesson that i found very very interesting and i definitely recommend to you guys is by ali abdal he's actually a doctor and a youtuber and it's on productivity principles and tools to boost your product productivity and i think that is so so important i procrastinate so much i always have excuses here and there where i just feel like i could get way more done in a day than i actually um do you know the quality of this class is actually really really on point now what's really exciting is that the first thousand of my subscribers that click in the link in the info box will get a free trial of skillshare premium membership so definitely get going guys i really recommend it and there's so much out there for you to learn and explore and with the given climate and situation at the moment i just feel like what best time to excel and improve your skills build yourself build on what you already have or learn something new and there's a lot of things that you can pick up on this platform that you can also add to a cv because at the end of the day it's experience it's something that you're learning from actual experts so yeah my skin is actually pretty dry right now so i'm just going to start with some of this what it do makeup refreshing spray wow you know when the mist is so fine it feels like a cloud that's basically what this is. I'm just gonna go in with some of the Pro Filter Instant Retouch Primer. I actually ran out with some of the Hydrating Primer, which I do prefer, but this is a new bottle of the, um, just the regular one. It's more on the matte side, but still pretty hydrating. Like before I discovered the hydrating one, I was really obsessed with this because it doesn't like dry my skin out or anything. Do you know what? It's so weird how, I don't know what the saying is, but how, it comes full circle i think that's the saying because um i remember when fenty beauty launched and everyone was so hyped i waited an hour or something in the queue in front of um, harvey nichols in the queue and i was so excited and then now i get sent stuff from them like what i mean it's so easy to forget the things you have now but i try to remind myself like back then i would have died like i would have given anything to get all of this and now like it's just given to me to try out and review for you guys it's just insane now i'm going to use the pro filter foundation in the shade 310 now i'm actually in shade 330 but it's more my summer shade and it does oxidize i do have full reviews on these products by the way and um i don't know i thought because i'm a bit more pale right now i, I try the 310 and i'm gonna use i'm gonna use the foundation brush by fenty So I remember like I went for an event and this is when I knew like I love this product, this foundation is it was boiling hot one day. I'm telling you like boiling, scorching hot and I went to Central, I went into the underground and this foundation did not budge. Now this will oxidize. I mean, it's not, I actually think it's not a bad match. It's better than the 330 because this will oxidize, you'll see. 
Okay, so I'm happy with how that blended out. I'm now gonna use some of the Pro Filter Concealer in the shade 310 as well. I might actually mix some of 330 because we don't want it too bright. I'm gonna use the concealer brush. We're just gonna take our time to blend this out. That blended, that blended effortlessly. Honestly, I'm so excited about like working with Skillshare and stuff because I've really been trying to like work on myself and how I can better myself every day, be more productive. Even like with the camera stuff, like there's so many lessons about how to use your camera and lighting and stuff and it's just so, so helpful. And it's even better that it's like there and like actual proper experts are te there teaching it. I'm just gonna put a little bit of 310 on my lids as well. God, I really like this brush as well. The brushes are new. Not new, but they're, they're new to me. Um, and they feel really nice. Now, just to add a bit of, um, of contour to my skin, I'm going to use the Cheeks Out Freestyle Cream Bronzer in the shade Chocolate. And I'm just using a stippling brush to slowly build that onto my cheeks. So I'm not putting too much, but it's already added a bit of colour already. Guys, I've been so obsessed with Lola's cupcakes. Like, not the cupcakes, but the brownies. And then I ordered cupcakes, but then I realised I'm not too much of a fan. And then now I ordered another box of brownies. But I swear to you, like, we need to get on that clean eating ASAP, okay? But I'm also trying to train myself not to, like, feel so guilty when I eat what I want. Like... I still need to live at the same time, you know. Okay, so next I'm just gonna set my under eyes um, with some Fenty Beauty Invisim Matte Blotting Powder, but I'm just gonna set my, just gonna set my under eyes. I love how like highlighted it is on my eyes. I'm just gonna do my brows a little bit. I'm now gonna use the Brow MVP. This is in the shade Black Brown. I shouldn't be showing this online, but it just comes to show how much I love this bronzer. This is the Sunstalker Instant Warmth Bronzer in the shade Caramel Cutie. I would honestly recommend this bronzer to anyone. I'm just going to build on top of the cream bronzer. Do you know, guys, the food that I've been really obsessed with lately is sushi. I don't know why. But I actually love sushi so much. And I think next weekend I'm going to make my um, Mauritian curry because me and my sister were kind of like craving it. And we look back at the video, which you guys can check out. It's like, I think it's like one of my most favorite videos I've made, which is where I made Mauritian curry. And it's so yum. And I just oh, I might have to make it this weekend. Next, I'm going to use this Kilowatt Foil Freestyle Highlighting Duo. And I've always wanted this one. I love this so much. But I think I'm going to go with the pink on the cheeks. This is what happens when I put blush. I just put way too much. It's okay, you can always blend it out. But it's definitely a blush slash highlight. And then I'm going to use the orange shade on my lids. I actually don't own any Fenty Beauty um, shadows. I should maybe get some. But I'm just going to make this look like, you know, those like fashion look, those fashion show um, looks where they're just like so simple, but so glam at the same time. I mean, that shade is so pretty. Like buff that out. 
do you know before the lockdown started i was this close to booking that like maldives trip that i really want to go to maldives one day and i was this close to booking it and then i was like actually let me wait a bit and then lockdown started and I, I my worst nightmare would be to be like stranded somewhere that i'm not like than here you know because i don't know i don't know like the idea of being stranded in another country just frightens me so much now i'm gonna use the fenty beauty full frontal mascara which is actually one of my favorite mascaras My hay fever is at its fullest right now. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's at its peak. I'm just gonna spritz some more um, setting spray. This is a stunning setting spray. Why haven't I bought this sooner? I'm actually really happy with the shade. The shade match is on point for my winter like skin. Oh my God, my nose is leaking. Okay, and then finally, I'm just gonna touch up with some lipstick. This is the Stunner Lip Paint in Uncuffed, which actually one of my subscribers told me to get and I absolutely love it. Alright guys, this is the final look. I'm really pleased. I mean, Fenty products never disappoint me, honestly. The only thing that I didn't get along with was the loose powder, which did not sit on my skin. I mean, I should give it another go because that was like a year or two ago. But like, I mean, look my skin looks so pretty and i love the glow i'm actually really obsessed with this blush slash got mascara all over my finger this blush slash highlight i hope you enjoyed this kind of like chit chatty video give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and don't forget also to check out the skillshare link only the first thousand people will get the two month free trial so definitely don't miss out on that and yeah i'll see you in my next video love you guys